Good morning, YouTube. I am still in my PJs, and I just remembered that I wanted to do a VR to Danu's Dragonfly. She did a very sweet video on her makeup collection where she was actually giving some of her makeup away, and then Cat W Magic did a video, and I just wanted to play makeup too with you ladies and show you some of my favorites and what I have too much of, and gosh, my makeup is really messy and dirty, so I can't believe I'm going to show it like this, but I am because I don't have time to clean it up right now. But this, I thought I would organize it after I got done making a video. So if makeup's not your thing, this probably isn't a video you want to watch. It's just basically girl, girl talk or, well, that's not true. You could wear makeup if you were a guy. I'm, I shouldn't make any judgments. Okay, so this is the first. Oh, and if you're not subscribed to um, Danny's Dragonfly, go check her out. She's new to the community and she's awesome. Okay, so this first basket is supposed to be powder, bronzing powder, and foundation and concealer. I really like these Wet n Wild bronzers. They're really cheap. They're like 3 or $4. I've got one in that shade and one in that one. I have to keep a couple of different shades because depending on how much sun, like if I've been going to the rock mine a lot or to the lake a lot, I need different, you know, shades for summer. I really love this Revlon Color Stay. This e.l.f. is all right. Actually, this is my car powder that I keep in the car. I just used it and accidentally brought it back in. Yes, I keep emergency powder in my car because I have the oiliest skin. I mean, some women just kind of like in the summertime, it just kind of glisten a little bit. I drip sweat, so it's not pretty at all. Here's some CoverGirl powder. Now, this is my favorite foundation, Revlon Color Stay Whipped. But I've been having a hard time finding it. I really, this is for when I've got a tan, the 200. I need it in 150, and every time I go to the store, they're out. So I've been making do with other stuff. This is some um, just you know what I've never even used it gradual tan anti-aging it came in a uh, what was the name of this little box as I used to do birch box one of the little beauty clubs and I've never even used it I did those clubs for a while that and the nail polish one um, I can't think of the name of the nail polish one and then I just got so much stuff and I wasn't using it fast enough I felt I felt bad so I stopped doing the beauty clubs. This is just CoverGirl body powder. It's got shimmer in it and it's just pretty for, you know, summer. This is super cheap. I got it at the Dollar Tree. I went and had my hair done one day and you know where the hair dye gets on your face. They took my makeup off and I just needed to um, fix my foundation really quickly. And it's what you would expect for a, a dollar. I mean, I've, it's not the worst makeup in the world for sure this is concealer photo ready Revlon it's okay not my favorite super stay 24 hour concealer um, I don't even know who this is by oh Maybelline these are good foundations the L'Oreal true match I enjoy those Let's see, and then I have some Neutrogena with the um, blemish treatment in it for when I was breaking out a little bit. That's okay. True Blend's okay. This is all right. So, um, oh, this is some bronzer by Stilla. And the only thing is you can't wear this with foundation because when you put it on it kind of beads up, kind of rolls underneath your fingers. It's, it's weird. It actually like beads up. More concealer. Got some e.l.f. glitter primer which I've never used so I can't tell you how that is. e.l.f. eyelid primer. You know I don't think I've ever used that one either. BB cream and some more little foundations. Oh that's supposed to go over there. So that's the foundation and powder slash concealer basket. 
And I've probably got more stuck in my purse, but we're not going to worry about that. I don't buy a whole lot of high-end makeup, mainly because the closest... There, let's just move that off to the side. The closest Ulta or Sephora is about 15, 20 minutes away. So if I need something, usually I just go to the drugstore and get it. These are some of those um, Wet n Wild glitter eyeshadows. It's my loose eyeshadow. There's gold. I haven't used those either, so I can't tell you. The color tattoo. I really like that. So, now, I really love these, and they're inexpensive. The LA Color Shimmering Loose Eyeshadow. I've got one in that color. Um, just some Rimmel. Or Rimmel. L'Oreal. Some more. Ulta. I re you can tell I really love that. That was a pretty set. Um, some MAC. Some more color tattoo. Some more color tattoo. And this is a good like little highlighting shade. If I can open it. It's pretty. Okay, so nothing too exciting. This is just more stuff for the skin. So those are like my small loose eyeshadows. And then I have a couple of palettes. I have this Sephora Moon Shadow Baked Palette. And it's really pretty. I really love it. Let me see if I can get it open. With one hand, let me see. Oh, man. Come on. Okay, yay, I did it. See, those are just gorgeous. So I really like that one. And I have a couple of these that came in like with perfume, you know, at the end of the, at Christmas time, they'll give you like a little gift and give you some makeup when you buy perfume. And I got, I think it was Beautiful for Christmas by Estee Lauder. And I got that with it, which you can tell I've hardly ever used. And then I think the year before, I got this one. So, on to, for blushes, I, have, I really don't have that many blushes. Let's see. I really like that one. This is my all-time favorite, NARS Orgasm see if I can get it open for you. This is the one I wear almost every day. And it's just, it's so pretty. Alright, we got some mascara. This is probably, Makeup Forever is probably my favorite mascara and I need some more of that. That was a little sample thing I got. Um, that one's good too, Maybelline Lash Sensational. I wasn't happy about that or this one Mally is pretty good that's a pretty good one I love these little eyeliners by Stella waterproof liquid eyeliner I've got one in brown and then let's see green I should have a purple one somewhere and there are some little liquid eyeliners. That's a lip liner. You get the idea. Oh, this is Hard Candy, the um, glitter mascara. And I usually put that over just a regular coat of black, like just on the tips of my eyelashes. And that's kind of cute. Okay, on to lipstick. My Secret Shame. How can one person, I mean, I'll never use this. It's ridiculous. Oh, this is cute. And that needs to be with my nail polish. Little rose, black nail polish. Anyway, so I just have some, what is that? Focus. I think that's Estee Lauder. Just have some pinks and 
Oh, I can't put the lid back on that. Let's see. What is this? Ulta. This is pretty good. This one right here. Oh, see, that's a mascara. That's That needs to be over there. Um, you know, not really too... I think I've got, like, one MAC lipstick, and I don't know where it is. It's a red that I really like. But, oh, there it is. But, since I live so far away, I just really don't have that many. This is my favorite red. And every once in a while, I will rock a red lipstick. I did like their lip gloss. Um lip gloss and I don't know where mine is or I would show it to you it's a little list three in packets so you get the idea there's tons of lip gloss um the Estee Lauder lip gloss is nice just you know the usual so that's a little pill case all right so nothing too exciting there I do want to show you my favorite thing that I get every year and this is the Sephora Blockbuster kit that they do at the end of every year and it's just you get so much in it and I think it was like $60 I got that for Christmas so you get those and you get oh come on you get those which I wear these more than the other ones and then on the second tier oh I hope I can open it Let's see. Oh, we'll go this way. Then you get some greens. You get some lip gloss. And this is where I use most of my blush from. Those are some... Oh, oh, sorry, guys. Those are some cream eyeliners. And this is where I usually get my blush from. I pick from those colors. So that's a really good deal for $60. You get a ton of makeup. All right. Well, this was kind of fun. Um, we should do this more often. <laughs> Blessed be everyone.